Welcome to the Elvis Music Show, where we celebrate the artistry of Elvis Aaron Presley. The Elvis Music Show is a production of Elvis Nation, which is a non-commercial organization that endeavors solely to promote Elvis Presley's rich musical legacy. Visit us at ElvisNation.org and also search for us on YouTube as well as Facebook. We are everywhere. We're rolling. It up, baby, before we fall apart at the seams. We got to patch it up, baby. We can't let time unravel our dreams. Let's go back and touch the past. One more night is all I ask. Get that feeling. And welcome to another edition of the Elvis Music Show, the Internet's radio show devoted to Elvis Aaron Presley and his rich musical legacy. I am your host, Brent Arnold of Elvis Nation. Oh my gosh, we got another hot potato for you today. This is going to be epic. The Elvis excitement level, they'll all go to 11 little spinal tap joke for everybody there. Oh my gosh, we got some killer segments. Uh, We have a segment devoted to Omaha, Nebraska concert, the evening show, April 12th, 1976, a 1968 comeback segment, along with another television segment, Elvis over on stage show. Uh, Just going to be some exciting stuff. And then we also have a segment totally devoted to a session glimpse. That's where we just take everything from that day and we pick three selections to give you an idea of what was going on in the studio on one given day of Elvis's storied career. Oh my gosh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, we start off with Patch It Up. Take one, written by Eddie Rabbit and Rory Bork. And that was recorded on Monday, June 8th, 1970 over at RCA Studio B 
in Nashville. Now, Patch It Up was released as a single with You Don't Have to Say You Love Me. And it was deemed as a double A side. I guess we're in the industry back then. That's where they said either side works as an A side. They're both dynamic presentations. And uh, so that was released in October of 1970. And Patch It Up ended up hitting number 11 on the Billboard Hot 100. So you gotta love it. You gotta love it. Okay, now we're going to head off to Omaha, Nebraska, April 22nd. 1976 over at City Auditorium. Ladies and gentlemen, three selections from Follow That Dreams collection called America. Let's do it. This next song is, is uh, this features the Stamps Quartet, ladies and gentlemen, on how great thou art. I know 
Too soon. Do something, honey. Hold my, hold my hand. My dear, I love records that I did, ladies and gentlemen, it's called It's Now or Never. I'd like to sing it for you. Before I do this, I'd like to tell you that, uh, well, I don't know if you heard or not, but day before yesterday, I, I woke up and I was married to some uh, chick down in Alabama. <laughs> and I was dead asleep, man. I didn't know anything about it, see? And I'm still available, and that chick's still waiting down in Alabama. <laughs> when I first saw you With your smile so tender My heart was captured My soul surrendered I spent a lifetime Waiting for the right time Now that you're here The time is here At last It's now or never Come hold me tight Kiss me my darling Be mine tonight Tomorrow Like a willow, we would cry in ocean if we lost true love and sweet devotion. Your lips excite me, let your arms invite me. For who knows when we'll meet again this way. There's no Wow, three stellar glimpses into that show. How Great Thou Art, Little Darlin', and It's Now or Never, the live evening show at City Auditorium, Omaha, Nebraska, April 22nd, 1976. The crowd in attendance that night was 10,546, not including the mystery wife that Elvis woke up to in Alabama. She didn't make the scene that night. That was that's that's one of those great legendary talking segments, isn't it? Now that night, Elvis was draped in the V-neck suit. The band dressed in blue. Nice little contrast there. So awesome. Elvis stretching his arms on the cover of this CD collection. You gotta get it. It just it is such an amazing picture. So Elvis is stretching his arms out. 
as the superhero he is, it looks like he's about to take flight, which he does figuratively also, because what a show that was. And again, that was the Follow That Dream labels, America. If you cannot find it, uh, I think at the time of this recording, it sold out. But, of course, the auction sites, there's always a way to nab a copy. Much uh, worth your investment to your collection. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to head now over to 1956. Stage show performances by Elvis Aaron Presley. Three different dates, three altogether killer moments. What do you say we fly? Thank you very much, friends. And now we'd like to do a song for you that we have on record. The song is called, I Was the One. Do, do, do. I do, do, was the one do, 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 do. who taught her to kiss the way that she kisses you now. And you know the way she touches your cheek. Well, I taught her how. I was the one who taught her to cry when she wants you under her spell. The sight of her tears drives you out of your mind. I taught her so well. And one day I had my love As perfect as could be She lived, she loved She laughed, she cried And it was all for me I, I never know Who taught her to lie now that it's over and done Who learned a lesson when she broke my heart I was the one And then one day I had my love As perfect as could be she lived, she loved, she laughed, she cried And it was all for me I'll never know I taught her to lie Now that it's over and done gentlemen, I'd like to present one of the radio's most listened to disc jockeys, Bill Randall. William? We'd like at this time to introduce you to a young fellow who, like many performers, Johnny Ray among them, come up out of nowhere to be overnight very big stars. This young fellow we saw for the first time while making a movie short, we think tonight that he's going to make television history for you. We'd like you to meet him now, Elvis Presley, and here he is. Well, get out of that kitchen and rattle those pots and pans. Get out of that kitchen and rattle those pots and pans. Oh, I'll ruin my breakfast cause I'm a hungry man. I believe you're doing me wrong and now I know. I believe you're doing me wrong and now I know. Cause the heart I wept the best of my money go. Well, let's shake, rattle and roll. Shake, rattle and roll. I said, shake, rattle and roll. I said, shake, rattle and roll. Oh, you won't do right to save your dog, don't so. Oh, yeah. Beep. 
sleeping in the seafood store. Well, I could look at you till you ain't no child no more. Well, I said, shake, rattle, and roll. 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 Oh, what you want to do right to save your dog don't so Baby, yeah. I don't know which way to jump Well, I said flip, flop and fly I don't care if I die I said flip, flop and fly I don't care if I die They won't ever leave me Don't ever say goodbye Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. And now, a little song that I have on record, and I'll see you, Victor, entitled Heartbreak Hotel. Well, since my baby left me, well, I found a new place to dwell. Well, it's down at the end of Lonely Street at Heartbreak Hotel, where I'll be. I'll be this lonely baby. Well, I'm so lonely. I'll be so lonely that I could die. Although it's always crowded, you still can find some room for broken-hearted lovers to cry their blues. So, I'll be so lonely, baby. I'll be so lonely. I'll be so lonely that I could die. Well, the bellhop tears keep flowing. The desk clerk's dressed in black. They've been so long on Lonely Street, they'll never, they'll never look back. And they're so, well, they're so lonely, baby. Well, they're so lonely. Well, they're so lonely, they could die. Well, now, if your baby leaves you, you got a tale to tell. Just take a walk down Lonely Street to Heartbreak Hotel. Well, you'll be, you'll be, be so lonely, baby. Well, you'll be lonely. You'll be so lonely, you could die. Go, go. Tears keep flowing. The desk clerk's dressed in black. They've been so long on Lonely Street. They'll never, never look back. And they're so, well, they've been so lonely, baby. Well, they've been so lonely. They'll be so lonely, they could die. What a segment that was. I wish I could have been there during that time to just, you know, those little black and white TVs with the fuzzy look to them. It just would have been magic. It was a whole new frontier back then of bringing rock and roll visually to the people. I was the one, and that was from the February 18, 1956 episode, Shake, Rattle, and Roll, and Flip, Flop, and Fly, and that was from January 28th. And then on February 11th, Heartbreak Hotel. Now, you hear Elvis in the 70s saying how he got his start on Jackie Gleason. Uh, but here's the thing. Jackie Gleason did not host this show. He was a producer of this show. So, yes, it was Jackie Gleason's production, but he didn't actually host it. The show took its about in, what, August? Yeah, it was August of that same year. So this was kind of on the tail end of that run. Uh, host Tommy Dorsey's death occurred just two months later, and his brother Jimmy died in 1957. They were the big band legends, also the host of this show. And, I, you know, guys, 
I always found it to be so odd that they died right after Elvis, in a short amount of time after Elvis really opened up the floodgates, okay? Because it was sort of like a symbolic passing of the guard. Now, on the flip side of that TV experience, we're going to travel 12 years later, 1968. Take seven. Seven. Da, 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 da. Escape section one, take one. I'm nearly about to start the death down in Memphis. I run out of money and luck. So I bought me a ride down to Macon, Georgia on an overloaded boat. Down to Panama City, started picking out some of them all night bars. Hoping I can make myself a dollar, make it here's going my guitar. Same old story, them all night rooms. There ain't no room around here for a guitar, man. <laughs> 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 Wait a minute. <laughs> Wrong. Good. Oh, no, no. They're too fast, man. That's the way I did it. Yeah, it's still too fast. <laughs> well, I nearly about starved to death down in Memphis. So I bought me a ride down to Macon, Georgia on an overloaded poultry truck. Thumbed on down to Panama City. Otherwise, I can't get to work. You ready? Take two. Escape section one. Take yeah. two. Ready, boobs? Uh, bones? Well, I nearly about starved to death down in Memphis. I run out of money and luck. So I bought me a ride down to Macon, Georgia on a overloaded phone. I thumbed on down to Panama City, started picking out some of them all night bars. Hoping I could make myself a dollar making music on my guitar. I got the same old thing you do fast, huh? Ain't no room around here for a guitar, man. <laughs> That's a take. Ready, balls? Escape section one, take five. Oh, you've been taking all these? You ready, Elvis? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Well, I nearly about starved to death down in Memphis. I run out of money and luck. So I bought me a ride down to Macon, Georgia on an overloaded poultry truck. I thought I'd go down to Panama City, started picking out some of them all night boys. I hoping I can make myself a dollar making music on my guitar. I got the same old story from all night peers. There ain't no room around here for a guitar man. Is that fast enough for you, Elvis? It seem a little too fast? What Irish eyes are so I used to drink. You said I used to sing. Section three, take two. One, two, three, four. One, two. I used to drink. I used to start all over. Okay, you need to. <laughs> Gospel section three, take four. 
I used to drink, I used to smoke, I used to smoke, drink, and dance the hoochie coo. I used to smoke and drink, smoke and drink, and dance the hoochie coo. Oh, oh, yeah. But now I'm standing on this corner, I'm praying for me and you. Ha, ha, ha. That's why I'm saved. I'm saved. People, let me tell you about a kingdom come. You know I'm saved. I'm saved. Well, I can preach until you're deaf and dumb. I'm in that soul-saving army, beating on that big bass drum. Ha, ha, ha. I used to cuss. I used to fuss. I used to cut fuss. To lie, cheat, step on people's feet. I used to lie and cheat, lie and cheat, and step on people's feet. Oh, oh yeah. But now I'm stepping on the glory. Salvation is my beat. You know, when you think about it, 1956 compared to 68, technology had changed, culture had changed, music had changed, everything changed so rapidly. If you think of like right now in 2024, you would see a few developments compared to 2012, but in general, a lot of it's kind of the same old, same old, with the exception of a few more apps and in increasing inflation okay i don't want to get depressed <laughs> all right ladies and gentlemen let yourself go part two guitar man's evil number three segment then guitar man from the escape number one segment takes one two and five and then saved gospel number three segment takes two and four oh my gosh uh june first two tracks june 20th 1968 and then Saved, recorded on June 22nd, 1968. And uh, we are now going to hop into some 
soundtrack play, starting off with first time ever appearance on this show. Cross my heart and hope to die. Let's do it. I can't explain about last night Though things didn't look just right Please believe me, there was nothing wrong I thought about you, baby, all night long Across my heart, I hope to die Well, I wouldn't tell you no lie You talk about a piece of a rotten luck You do a friend a favor and you wind up stuck she couldn't hold a candle to you, no siree Very hard to handle like a Model T Across my heart, I hope to die Well, I wouldn't tell you no lie Please believe me when I say Why horses couldn't drag me away from you Cause I don't have to look too hard To see what I got in my own backyard So uh, be forgiving and forget Don't say my alibi's all wet I miss those kisses from your honeycomb This humble bumblebee just wants to fly back home I cross my heart, I hope to die Well, I wouldn't tell you no lie I wouldn't tell you no lie, no, 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 no. I said, now shake it. That's a mother. <laughs> 2047. More than the greatest love. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Four, eight. Hear my serenade. One, two, three, four. Come here, my serenade, my desert serenade, a lover's melody to bring you close to me. It's a tender lullaby. Born of golden sand and sky The song is new And it's calling you Tonight beside the desert bar Come let me take you in my arms Come hear my serenade my desert serenade Wherever lovers dwell It's weaves, it's magic spell Soon a thousand dreams will start And romance will fill your heart My lips conceal All that's warm and real Give me the chance to hold See a brand new world appear. So come in here, my desert serenade, my desert serenade, my desert serenade. This one boy loves two little girls. Folks 
say Three is a crowd To each boy One girl's allowed But right now I'm having such fun I just can't give up either one Cause this one boy Loves two little girls There will come a time I'll have to settle down But until that time I love two girls Hanging around Now one day I must decide which one I'll choose for my bride. But till we three must part, I've twice as much love in my heart. Cause this one boy loves to. And we started off that set with Cross My Heart, Hope to Die, written by Ben Weissman and Sid Wayne from the Girl Happy soundtrack, recorded Thursday, June 11, 1964, at Radio Recorder Studio B in Hollywood. Now, Cross My Heart and Hope to Die was the first song recorded during this session. For the master recording, it was comprised of a splice of takes 9 through 11. And then after that, making its debut also, My Desert Serenade takes two and three, written by Stanley J. Uh, Gelber, and that was recorded on Thursday, February 25th, 1965, over at RCA Studio B in Nashville. Now, the flutist during these sessions was Rufus Long, probably the song where his talent shined most, in my opinion. Uh, was during Animal Instinct on that soundtrack. Of course, uh, the movie in question, Harem Scarum. And then we rounded out the set with One Boy, Two Little Girls from Kissin' Cousins, written by Bill Giant, Bernie Baum, and Flores Kate. Now, everybody get this. The track was laid down on September 29th, but Elvis didn't lay his vocal overdub until October 10th. That didn't happen a lot in those days, but every now and then it still did happen. Okay, next now we're going to board a time machine and travel to RCA Studio B for a session glimpse. Now, ladies and gentlemen, if you're new to this, this is a recurring bit where we feature a block of tracks at various recording stages to get a kind of a glimpse of what went on in the studio that day. And the day that we're focusing on for this episode, Sunday, June 25th, 1961, the Steve Scholes produced session, get this, this is a lot of work, my friends. It ran from 6 p.m. till 7.30 a.m. And without further ado, enjoy this session glimpse. M to WW0860, take three. One, two, three. Two, Day, Cause he was telling everyone in town About the love that he'd just found And Marie's the name of his latest flame He talk and talk And I heard him say That she had the longest, blackest hair And the prettiest green eyes anywhere And Marie's the name of his latest flame Though I smiled, the tears inside were a burning I wished him luck and then he said goodbye He was gone but still his words kept returning What else was there for me to do but cry? Would you believe that yesterday 
This girl was in my arms and swore to me She'd be my eternity And Marie's the name of the latest flame Though I smiled, the tears inside were a burn I wished him luck and then he said goodbye He was gone but still his words kept returning What else was there for me to do but cry? Would you believe that yesterday This girl was in my arms and swore to me She'd be my eternity And Marie's a name of his latest flame Yes, Marie's a name of his latest flame Oh, Marie's a name Or if you stand there and smile, I'm singing better. Take one. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, take two. All right. Little sister, don't you? I can't hardly hear you. <laughs> Little sister, don't you? <laughs> huh? Yeah. Burn. 
sister, don't you? Little sister, don't you? Little sister, don't you kiss me once or twice and say it's very nice and then you run. Little sister, don't you do what your big sister done? Well, I dated your big sister and I took her to a show. I went for some candy, along came Jim Bandy and they snuck right out the door. Little sister, don't you? Little sister, don't you? Little sister, don't you kiss me once or twice and say it's very nice and then you run. Little sister, don't you do what your big sister does. Every time I see a sister, well, she's got somebody new. She's mean and she's evil like a little old boy. Evil, guess I'll try my luck with you. Little sister, don't you? Little sister, don't you? Little sister, don't you kiss me once or twice and say it's very nice and then you run. Little sister, don't you do what your big sister does? Well, I used to pull your pigtails and pinch your turned up nose, but you've been growing and baby it's been showing from your head down to your toes. Little sister, don't you? Little sister, don't you? Little sister, don't you kiss me? And say it's very nice and then you run Little sister, don't you do what your big sister does Little sister, don't you do what your big sister does Little sister, don't you do what your big sister does Oh, you gotta love these session glimpses, how sweet it is. Sunday, June 25th, 1961, over at RC Studio B in Nashville, Tennessee. Started off with Marie's the name of his latest fleet. Dun, 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 dun. And I'm not going to do that because I cannot sing or mimic any instrument in key. Take three is what we heard. And it took a few more takes to become the master. Take eight to be precise. And then that's someone you never forget. Take one, first rollout. Elvis and Red West writing. Oh my gosh, it's such a haunting song. So beautiful, so intimate. You just, oh, it, I, I'm just getting shivers down my spine just thinking about it. It's just such an enchanting number, always will be. And then Little Sister takes one through three, written by Doc Palmas and Mort Schumann. And that could be found on Follow That Dreams, the Potluck Sessions. It's a three disc, uh, is it three disc or four? Okay, my mind's going. Okay, I expected my mind to go like this at like 80, but I'm forgetting stuff in my early 50s. So is this coming attractions for what's to come down the pike in my brain? I do not know, but I will savor every last minute. Now with Little Sister, get this. This was the last song recorded during the session and it ran 12 takes with the last one serving as the master so much fervor so much vim considering that they've already been doing this for about nine or ten hours or so grinding the gears before they even got to little sister okay ladies and gentlemen what do you say we head to boston Left a good job in the city Working for the man every night and day And I never lost one minute of sleep Worrying about the way things might have been A big wheel keep on turning How many people on burning You were rolling, rolling, rolling Rolling, rolling on a river Ain't a lot of place down in Memphis I'm a lot of pain down in New Orleans But I never saw the good side of the city Till I 
hit you right on a river boat I'm queen. That's what I'll be queen. queen. Keep, keep on turning. My man, I keep on burning. No way I roll it. gotta love it anything elvis you just gotta love it and you know what i love elvis but i love you guys too i love doing this for you guys and i love celebrating elvis's rich artistic legacy thank you so much everybody for tuning in i wish you all to get your piece of the peace and always remember tcb